What's up guys, in this video I will be showing you how to tie the hare's ear nymph with a hothead. For this fly you will need a nymph hook size 12, orange tungsten ball heads, a pheasant tail feather, natural colored rabbit dubbing, hare's golden brown ice dub, tan 6 op thread, and a small spool of gold wire. I will leave a link to each of these materials in the description below. First you will need to put the orange ball head onto the hook and clamp the hook into the vise. I prefer to use a 3.8mm ball head to fit the size 12 hook. Then you will grab your 6 knot thread and wrap that bad boy from the ball head to the bend of the hook and snip off the excess thread. Then you'll grab about 5 to 8 barbs from your pheasant tail feather and tie that onto the back of the hook about a hook shank in length. Next, cut about a 2 inch piece of wire off your spool and tie that sucker in next to the pheasant tail. At this point, you'll grab a pinch of your brown rabbit fur dubbing and spin that onto the thread. Once spun onto the thread, you'll start to wrap the fly with dubbing. Do a couple of wraps behind the excess pheasant tail and then wrap all the way to the front behind the ball head. Then in the opposite direction, you wrap the hairs dubbing. You will wrap the gold wire around the dubbing and around the excess pheasant tail. Once to the bead head, you will do a few wraps around the wire and snip it off. Now you will fold the excess pheasant tail down and tie that right behind the bead head and do a few wraps and trim that excess off. Finally, grab a small pinch of the ice dub and give it a few wraps behind the head to give it a nice collar, something a little extra to set this fly apart. Now whip finish and voila dude. This fly is perfect for runoff and spawning season, so get out there and catch a freaking pig, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.